It's an ongoing eyesore for people living in Tempe. Graffiti everywhere. And a survey from 2021 reveals there's been a real surge in tagging over the last five years. Team 12's Chase Golightly spoke with city leaders about this problem and what led to it getting so out of hand. You don't have to go too far to find graffiti in Tempe. We saw this just driving down Apache near McClintock and on the other side of this fence, even more. It's an expensive problem for the city, and now they're trying to play catch up to fix it. From alleyways to backyard fences. Tagging is frequent. Graffiti is a common problem in the Hudson Manor neighborhood in Tempe. I don't think it's ever going to go away. Phil Amorosi has lived here for decades and is now looking at this. And you can see wall to wall graffiti and tagging. This isn't what he wants in his neighborhood. But it doesn't look good for the rest of the neighborhood and people that do their morning walks. Now he says the city of Tempe responds quickly to these calls and they do come out and clean it up as soon as possible. City officials say it costs Tempe anywhere from $80,000 to more than $100,000. But during the pandemic, it felt like the problem got worse. And then you just saw more of it accumulate. And he's not wrong. Tempe has a program to combat tagging. And according to its recent survey, there were 69 graffiti tags in 2019. That number jumped to more than 400 in 2021. They are on a daily basis. Isaac Chavira with the city says the reason for this surge has to do with everything COVID-19 brought. They didn't have enough staff or even the proper supplies to clean up the graffiti. Obviously, that wasn't good for us, doesn't look good on us. Leading to them falling behind on those efforts. But a lot of times, we you know, we play the, the, the cards that were dealt. But now Chavira says the situation has changed. They are fully staffed. As of today, uh, currently meeting the 24 to 48 hour response time. Able to once again go out and clean this up. But he does tell us there is some catching up to do. We're out there daily abating graffiti. Now the latest survey regarding the graffiti situation in Tempe will be released in the next few months. And city leaders tell me they believe that new number will be lower. We're in Tempe tonight. Chase Golightly, 12 News.